The idea of a high mileage seven passenger SUV is an appealing one. The ability to haul your family, friends, and all their stuff while simultaneously getting good MPGs is akin to having your cake and eating it too. Unfortunately, the new Ford Explorer EcoBoost doesn't have any cake. It's an intellectually dishonest vehicle. It looks roomy, but it's not. It looks sporty, but it's not. And the interior looks good, but that My Ford Touch is a mess. We're sad to report that it's just a bad vehicle. It's hard to remember such a dynamically lifeless SUV. A weak engine equals a slow truck, but for mommies hauling four girls off to ballet class, who cares? Still, 240 horsepower and 270 pound-feet of torque should be faster than 0 to 60 in 9.2 seconds and a leisurely quarter mile time of 16.9 seconds. That's what a 4,500 pound curb weight gets you. Yes, yes, fine. You don't buy the EcoBoosted Explorer for performance. You buy it to sip fuel. Well, during our rear world testing, the two liter Explorer returned a combined 19.9 miles per gallon, exactly 1.5 miles per gallon better than the standard 3.5 liter V6. That's an improvement, sure, but not an earth shattering one. But hey, at least it's $1,000 more expensive. The Explorer is based on the Taurus, and you can imagine what happens when you stretch and repurpose a five-passenger sedan into a seven-seater SUV. Compromise, and lots of it. So there you have it. Slow, clumsy, pricey, thirstier than we would have thought, and a packaging disaster. The new Ford Explorer EcoBoost is not a Motor Trend favorite. Because after all, if you remove sport and utility from an SUV, what are you left with? Here's to next time.